Hello guys, Imano here from Whippy Marks, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to change the number of products per page in WooCommerce. So if you go over to your WordPress website and you navigate to the uh, shop uh, page, you're going to notice we have uh, uh, we have different products being displayed here. And in this video, I'm just going to show you how you can limit the number of um, products being displayed per page. So you could have 50 products here you could have 10 or 5 and i'm also going to show you how you can change the number of columns so by default i think you have four and so i'm going to show you, you can change this to something like three or five or six or whatever number you want so there are different ways of doing this um the most common way of changing or playing around with the total um products here is going over to customize okay so just click on the customize option on your wordpress website and over here you're going to get this woocommerce bar so just click on woocommerce and select product catalog okay so product catalog is just uh, whatever uh, is being displayed here so what we're interested in is the products per row and products per page okay so um and rows per page so i could change the total number of rows to four and okay, let's just do that quickly let's change the row to okay, let's change the row to two and see how that looks so now as you can see we only have two um products per row i could change this to five and we'll have five products per row which makes this five um, columns so this first products per row um option allows you to control the number of columns that you want okay so if i type six we're gonna have six columns of products for each row okay then over here you can select the total number of rows you want in a, um, a page so if i put one here we're just gonna have one row of um, six different products okay so it's very easy to use if you you could use this to uh, limit the number of products that you want on your um, page so if i want if i wanted 10 different um, products i would just type in uh, five here so we have five per row and we just have two rows okay so if you have two rows you have five here you have five over here also okay so it's very easy to use this um, option here for uh, controlling the total number of products displayed on your website so um, in some themes you're not going to get this option so some themes do not offer this option um, themes that don't uh, support WooCommerce are not going to have this option and sometimes some other themes are just going to have like an a custom made version of this WooCommerce bar that allows you to control the total number of products okay so if you if you don't find this here just read about your theme and check the theme documentation and you should find a way to control whatever is here so in some themes you might not even have any option at all to control um, the page so i'm just i'm going to show you how you can do that uh, we're going to need to resort to using some codes so if you go back to the article on um, whip marks you're going to see this code snippet here so what this snippet allows you to do is limit the total number of products being displayed on uh on the uh product page okay on the shop page so you don't really have control over the columns but you can control the number of products so i'm just going to go back and i'm gonna go over to appearance click on team editors because we want to add this code so just copy this code over here i'm gonna copy this and we'll go over to team editor and click on team functions so the function.php file just click on this and scroll to the bottom of the page okay so whenever you want to add anything to your themes um function file always added to the bottom of the page so i'm just going to paste this here so this um 16 here is the total number of products i want to be displayed if i change this to something like three and i update the file let's see if that works so as you can see now we only have three products being displayed per page or per um navigation page here okay so this is page one if i go to page two i only get three three products so you could control this from here if you want 
change this to five and let's see now we have five products okay so you could also control the total number of um, columns um, if this code does not work for you you can just try you can try using this other one here so the do the exact same thing and you can try using this if this doesn't work you can also use this uh, so you can also change the total number of columns per page just like um, in the customized bar but in some themes this is not gonna work so um, you can just copy this also and go to the bottom of the page and paste it over here okay so these two filters are just emulating what we got at our cost um, customized bar in the WooCommerce customized bar so they just help you to control everything without if your theme does not support um, the WooCommerce bar in the customized section okay so th that's what um, these two filter does you can change this to four if you want four field four col um, columns change this to three or whatever number you might want okay so I'm just gonna get rid of everything here and I'm going to show you an easier way of doing this. Okay, so if you don't want to use any of these codes, you can also use a plugin called Woo Shortcode Kit. Okay, so with Woo Shortcode Kit, you get the exact same option, and you don't really need to add any um, code to your um, WordPress site. So I'm just going to refresh this page. Okay, I need to save this first. I'm going to refresh this page so we get back our default look. So the name of the plugin um, is Woo Shortcode Kit. So we're gonna go over to our dashboard, over to plugins, and click on Add New. Okay. So once we're here, just I'm just gonna paste in the plugin name with Woo Shortcode Kit, and I already have this installed. So I'm just gonna click on Activate. So this plugin is very easy to use. Once you install it, just come over to WooCommerce and you're going to see WSHK or you could just click on settings over here directly from the plugin section and it's going to take you to this, uh, to the plugin dashboard. So just scroll down to you get to the customize the shop page or build a new one. Just click on this and find the product page manager. So just activate this and click on this show advanced option here. So when you click on this, it's going to give you a space where you could add total number of products you want to be displayed on a page. So I could type in two and click on this icon here to save. Okay. So once you do that, let's refresh the page and see if that works. So now as you can see we will have two products per page. Okay. So it's very easy to use the plugin if you don't want to use the code and um, all you have to do is just come over here and activate this and add any number here and it's going to limit the number of products being displayed on your shop page so i hope you guys found this video useful if you have any questions you can leave a comment below and you can like the video if you found it useful and subscribe to our channel for more content with that out of the way i'll see you guys in the next video